late to the party on this one. Another play series instrument called Ignition Keys. I was on vacation, but my buddy bro, 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 Bo Tyler already made a video on this. I'll put a link to his in the description. There's a bunch of other great videos on it already, including Native Instruments own video. Wasn't going to make a video on this. And then I played one patch and instantly had a song. So whenever that kind of stuff happens, I'm like, all right, this looks like it'd be a fun one to explore with you guys. So I'm going to go through it, play a few of the patches, see if we can come up with an idea that fleshes out what I already started with. Now, the thing with these play series instruments, I've got lots of videos on them. I've got one very specific video that if you don't watch this one, go watch that one because I go over why I think it has one of the best sequencers in the industry. And it's very simple. It's a very simple reason, but we'll play around with that a little bit in this video. And make sure you go watch that one. It gives you a really good overview of the Play Series instruments and what's exciting about them. But Native Instruments keeps cranking these ones out. They are basically just more patches for the same virtual instrument is how you can kind of think of it. You might already have a lot of sounds that work for you in a certain genre. So that's why it's important before you just go spending your money on these that you find out if this one is right for you, if it's gonna help you. Hit that link in the description if you like it, because it is an affiliate link and I get a kickback. All right, well, let's check it out. So the actual initial thing that I started with was this Bad Dreams patch, which is a piano patch. I love how this, this one has this pulsing thing that comes in after. Let's put some basic chords in there. All right, let's go look at some more patches. One bass patch. I'd love to see more patches on these instruments. Don't worry, there's a lot more in everything else. That's kind of a cool patch though. Okay, so let's see what we've got for the macros. These are the, the things that they've assigned. Patch creator decided these will be cool things to have immediate control over. And of course you can change all of those. Don't forget with play series instruments, you have two layers. So this balance switches between the two. All right, let's put some bass in. some other patches. We'll go over to uh, Ignition Keys so that we can get a preview in Complete Control. Now let's play with the macros. So I'm going to touch them here on the Complete Control, but we've got them right here. So we've got Cutoff. Color. So I'm just going to automate this. I've got automation turned on. And I'm going to right click this one and go learn MIDI CC. And we're going to assign it to this one right here. There we go. So that should work. And you know what I decided after writing that in that it might be more fun to have this whole thing just kind of curve up and then curve down. Let's go see what else we've got in here. Let's go through this category right here. We can see choir. Actually, get rid of the choir on that and just go to this bells. Keys, I would hope, is where this one shines. So let's see what these patches are all about. We got destroy. I'm sure if we turn that one down. A nice patch. Piano. Oh, that's nice. 
Let's see what the balance does. On this side. I like that. It's got a bit of a percuss percussive sound to it. All right, we'll just play a couple more of uh, these keys patches just so you can hear what's in there. I love the space control on these ones. retirement. That's funny to only old people like me. There's some really nice batches in here. Oh wow. This patch is called Event Horizon. Really digging this one. I love that soothing lead sound on the right here. Could work nicely in here. Let's put that in. Lots of lead sounds, that's great. So monophonic patch. Oh, that is a really nice patch. Let's see if they have any sequenced patches in here. There we go. They don't show up in this category, but they do show up in the complete control browser. Oh, wow. Let's go to the sequencer. So we can hear it's got semitones and stuff in there. Key is C. Let's set this to C minor. So it's going up there to that A flat. Let's take that up to a B flat. So we're going to go up to a minor seventh. Take this up a fifth, so we'll go right there to a fifth. Set this to maybe a minor seventh. Now let's play with the balance of the patch. Let's get rid of a few of these notes. Let's get rid of that one. And let's put that one on the offbeat. Make sure you watch my other video on the sequencer because I go over all of that, the details of that one for sure. Bit of a taste of the sounds in there. Now I'm just going to load up a damage kit, play along with this and play it out. So hopefully that helped you make a decision on this one. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button and the bell. We'll see you in the next video.